Welcome to Third Party. Third Party with Jaiga, Nikki, and Rody. <laughs> Yes, sir. I want to say welcome to it. This is the third party. You know, we do we inside the spaces each and every Wednesday. This is where we come to unwind. Um, a lot of people complain that we missed them. Well, Nikki did chastise me to the grung. Eh? The beat my beat my beat my beat my beat my beat my bad. The for, yeah, for that because it was supposed to be there's two spaces we were supposed to miss because um I, you know we wanted to shut down so close off the end, start back fresh in the new year, but it turned out to be three because the um i shut down the last one and i didn't get a chance to tell people to be the last one and we shut down well boy the call all kind of thing the say who are some woman named gwen avine boys all kind of back and out but that's a whole next story yeah that's a whole next story the when they get on over again on. the t- the tell of the self kevin is now the best storyteller we have ever heard he could tell a story now boy the thing i could tell story he's the new boss he could tell a story but nevertheless we are here we got better wi-fi aha uh-huh. cnm you reach you reach you reach hold on I remember him popping me in one time. I know see him. He's a little late, but he's coming in. You understand? So, once again, for those of you all newcomers, if you're shy, remember, you can send a WhatsApp and be played in real time. That's at 7899 You understand? That's the number for you to get inside. You can send a, um, a WhatsApp and be played the WhatsApp in real time. So, that's uh, if you don't want to get your, let your voice be heard in here. Rodel! Hey, hey, Rody. Yo. Yeah, you reach. What's going on with you, bro? Walk what? Oh, I'm so happy to be in the room this 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 week. Happy to have you, Nikki. <laughs> Laura and the Rody, I heard you've been behaving badly on the radio, saying what you want. You know, the only thing you're doing is almost cussing. What's going on? That's not true. That's not true at all. Well, Lily and them will let me know. See, so that's so, so that you just you just line on provoke, Jed, just so you just line that your new thing. You just, you, oh, just... you, you share not that same. Of joke. course, that. of course, you, wow. you, so you, you just you just seeing and doing what you want and then coming here and lie about it. So, all right, cool, no scene, no scene, no scene. No so, what's the topic tonight? Well, last thing, what's the topic last week? We allowed people to come in and talk. It was such a nice space last week, Nicola. Vexing Mr. Everybody who just was kind of open forum kind of vibe. You understand? Uh-huh. I, did, I find the topic that was... Sometimes bro- I think we need to do that, that pseudo jive, you know, yeah. for people to just come and, and have nice so we could just talk about what's on their mind. Yeah, true that, true that, true that. And um, you might have to do that because the one that, that was brought forward for this week, I kind of find it heavy. I really don't want to talk about vaccination. Yeah. I really don't want to talk about family who... um. Who in who yeah. in talking to who because they ain't vaccinated and I felt uh, about yeah, it. Yeah, it's just uh, let's I have f- a nice nice night to kick off. Yeah. So let let let's uh, let, let hear from our listeners now. All right, well here what we'll do. Them. Let me hear from Lily and Kevin and them. Right, last week, last week we and did Laura. record. We did not record. We did not record. We recorded in tonight. So I guess we'll do that. Seeing that you're here, so we'll treat this one as the first official space of 2020 new. You think? The first, the first official space of 2020 new. That is what we're doing. All right. So um, let me see what's coming in first. Who coming in hot? I've seen Kelly is in the house. I've seen uh, Marlene. I've seen Neighbor. Well, Dr. Marley is already here. Um, Neighbor. Let, let me start with Lily. Lily, say some good nights now if you're wrong. Because I know you do the wrap up. But come on. Lily, come I miss my sister. We miss you so desperately, Nikki. Right. Apparently, Jaiga and Rudy and Raw. Pull a bio to the side and tell it goes to off thing here. Wow. So like, wow. Well, wow. she will, you know, it will, it will, she will loosen up. The yeah. mouth will get hot as the time goes on. You're giving her a yeah, little hot mouth. Yeah. Marlene. Well, Lily, stop that. I said, Marlene, Miss Marlene. Girl, I know, I know, I know, I know. Don't tell me. But I miss you. I miss you. Um, your girl is doing a great job. Uh-huh. Rudy, on the other hand, I know what's going on with he. What I don't know how much he has said. <laughs> I'm a Zeta says I'm big and salt. 
Rodi, that is the second complaint I got about you. What is going on? Oh God, where's all fun though? Either I need to get the room. United, say good night. Good night. Nikki, like your boy United. I miss him. I never yeah. thought I'd say this. <laughs> Talk to you. <laughs> you miss me, Nikki. Go line on it. Go line. Go line. <laughs> go line. <laughs> good night, Nikki. United. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nikki, Nikki, she'll be Nikki. I never thought I'd ever say this. Yes, United. Pleasant night. Good night. You're staying for the whole show tonight? Daddy, you're seeing your sad that you'll get okay. cut off, eh? You'll get cut off. I just asked him. Do do with I that. I'm your friend, boy. Do do with that. I'm your start, friend, boy. If you're starting with that heavy energy, you'll have to get you out of here. Alright? Have a blessed <laughs> night, brother. Enjoy the show. We're having a light show tonight. We're yep. calling this one the first one of 2020. New. Nicole is in the space. We're all here. Everything is nice. Avril, good night. You know what? Oh, Avril. Hi, pleasant. Good night, guys. What's Avril. going on? <laughs> Nikki, darling. I miss you, girl. Girl, like, 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 huh? If you only mm-hmm. know it. But <laughs> get it, right? Mm-hmm. Rodel is the right. new driver. Wow. See? You see? Yeah. You see? I yeah, good. What about Jaiga? Jaiga, that's right, Avra. Wow. Oh, that's yeah, like all Jaiga that he wins. Yeah. Wow. wow. Oh. And and the turn in Kevin. <laughs> yeah. Well, I told you, all, I warned you, all, eh? I warned you when Jaiga was in New York, like with Kevin, I say all year, all year. All uh, right. Kevin going to. That's all Nikki, I got to say. Nikki, this morning, Rudy contributed. Yeah, to scrubism and telling fellas that it is okay to be a scrub <laughs> and tell, and basically giving them the, 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 the tips four and pointers. Ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How to be tips homeless in somebody place. Be <laughs> Rudy advocating wow. for homelessness. I, 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 I thought I was just warning, warning young ladies out there this morning. You know. That's the one. So You showed us what you showed us. If we didn't know, you showed us what a scrub was, and then you gave fellas at the same time tips and tricks of how to be a uh, a well pampered scrub. Yeah. But hopefully, I'm dying. But I, I see a lot of scrubs out here. Yeah, because I see a lot of scrubbing out here. Well, Nicole, for men out here are very prepared to take care of man out here. Like Nicole, and Jaga come in. He wants Ro- to be taken yep. care too. Rudy, Jaga wants to go there. Rudy said that um, being a homeless is like we having a government work. Who wants to give up a government work? So we decided that <laughs> the new the new job to look for is Tasha. Dot tt dot gov because that's the only way to survive. Wow. So I tell him I am on the quest to look for Tasha. Dot tt dot gov because Rudy says our government work is easy to get and you don't ever lose it. It's just stay in the work and cock up your foot, right? <laughs> and I, at some point, I agree. And there's a generation, the younger generation, I've seen it out there. All the women hey. taking care of the fellas out here. Yeah, I know. Yeah, they, they're the ones swiping the cards, they're the ones. Driving, they driving the cars, etc. And it's, it's a thing. Wow. <laughs> it's a thing. Oh. But what Jaga don't know, them government jobs does eat with spoon. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Oh, kill Hold me. On. Marine come down from there. I don't eat with spoon. Eh? <laughs> kill me. Kill you know, me. <laughs> hey, I go in, miss. I think tonight as is our first. Is our first, you know, show to kick off the new year in. I think we should kind of put our what we want to do this year out there in the air. You know, sometimes we 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 hold these dreams in and we we want to do something, but we kind of shy. But I think we should share some of our dreams because you know, if you realize in life too short, you have to do what you have to do now. Yeah, that's cool. My and dream. We, all we're we're not doing. We're my not, dream is so we're, dropping in my DM. We're not doing resolutions, yeah. <laughs> What we doing? What we doing is you no, put, no, no. you put your put your put your dream forth forward, and we everybody in the space. Yeah, what you want to do this year? Everybody in the space will call hold you accountable. We will hold you accountable. Six months from now, we are gonna ask so you Remember, you say you want to do so. Exactly. So we holding you accountable. Before we start, Kelly from New Jersey, 
Are you back in New Jersey, Kelly? Oh, Kelly, pleasant good night, everybody. Yes, I'm back from this morning. Oh, I just want to say, Nikki, first of all, I miss you. I miss you so much. But oh, I, you, you know, I miss Trinidad. But I have to say, let me tell you, Bunny. I don't know where he, I think I tried to call him. I think he in a meeting or something. But that is my brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah this is already my brother. Let me tell you, Bunny took care of me from start to finish. We go in Ojo, I see in Jaiga, I see in Rodi, I see in Abby, I see in Sakil. I just couldn't believe it. It was so nice. I see Damien at Frankie's and I was kind of drunk, but that's the next thing. Mm. But what I want to say is that with Bunny, it's like we actually took for like a year and never met in, met in each flesh until last week. And it was like, we ain't never met uh. in each. And Jaiga, I... You, you need to know this. I just want to thank you because of the platforms. I meet these wonderful folks. I had to big up my boy Ace of Space as well. The same way. It's like Ojo family is the greatest. And like I had a blast in Trinidad. But you know all the things have to come to an end. So. I hear that. Yeah. Uh, I hear that. I hear Kelly that. can call New Jersey girl. It's cold and right now. And Kevin. You nasty dog. Kevin. Wow. I gotta say, Kevin, a nasty dog. Wow. My dick wow. and shock was nice, though. Wow. Well, let's, <laughs> let's, let's, let's let's keep the name calling down the new year, guys. Let's try and change our ways. Let's try and uplift each other. <laughs> say words of affirmation towards each other. Say, you you have an amazing day, bro. You're an amazing person. Just stop calling each other dog and you nasty. Kevin, I, I love you. <laughs> Kevin, I love you, but my dick and shock was nice. It was um, sweet and it, 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 Jagger, I love to tell you freedom to express the context in which she said Kevin is a nasty dog. Now, we want to know all that. <laughs> all it's right. a new show, Lily. Let's put this in a Lily White show. <laughs> a, okay? This one. Just this one. Let me welcome <laughs> Let me welcome Laura to the spaces. Laura, good night. For those that of you. Good night. So for those of you who don't know, Laura is an amazing journalist. She's somebody who has really been... An amazing woman, an amazing, a mother, oh, well, everything. Well, let me done my amazing Laura. friend. Let me done all my amazing Laura. friend. She's all of that. She's also... A, a, and why I love her, she's, she is a citizen of so kind of love of the arts. So you know, once a day I for you. Yeah. So this is our girl, Laura. She's yeah. in the space. Good night. Good night, everybody. Thank you, Chico. Oh, gosh, I love all you. Hi, Nikki. Hi, Rosie. Laura. <laughs> Happy uh, New Year. How did uh, you run? They got it. It's a mouse a house and land. I know. I can't. Laura, you have it's three boys you have, right? Or four? Yes. Yes, three. Three. And how old are they? Seventeen. How old are they? Seventeen, wow. thirteen, and seven. Oh, good. I really did. That yeah, is neat. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> then don't I'm, stop. I got to come down there for a little extra to do a little side hustle just now. Yeah, sure, right. Because I can't keep up with the groceries. All them born them eating, them eating right. house and land. How so, Laura, we talking, we talking our dreams. And I know for a fact this is important here for you. You're celebrating your yes. big five O this year. I am. This is my year of 50. I am celebrating. I was freaking out a little bit initially last year. Oh, yeah. Thank you, woman. Did we go through that? Yeah, the prospect of turning 50 is like, oh my God, how the hell did I repair? Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my but, God. You know what? It's going to happen whether or not I accept it. So I decided exactly. to celebrate. And so this entire year is dedicated to me cele- turning 50. A lot of my friends are turning 50. It is a mm-hmm. huge milestone. And I'm going to celebrate the entire year. So that's my plan. That's awesome. That's awesome. You know, Jerry, the hubby always, he has a saying that I share with everybody. He says the first Thursday is for everybody. It's for you yes. to love your family, your wife, your husband, your children, da, da, da. You see, the next Thursday is for you. Damn right. The next Thursday is for <laughs> you. So, it is for me. Do, yeah, yeah. So, and your whole thinking, I think, you know, as you get closer to see it, your whole thinking change, you know, you don't give a shit basically. No, you don't, you really you know what, it's, it's an unconscious thing you have, you really come and into you get yourself older. Yeah. yeah, you come into yourself you accept yourself with all your flaws and everything, you become a lot more confident, you, you know yeah. you still feel youthful and energetic you still feel like I you think have it a starts in the 40s, it starts in the 40s yes, you start to yes. kind of find yourself and and you, you, when you're younger as a woman, I think you, you, you're always trying to impress. You want to know what mommy will say, what this one would say. Yeah. When you reach first that fifth day, you don't give a shit what nobody Not it. Not it. <laughs> not it. I do not care. 
what anybody thinks. <laughs> that's awesome. That's awesome. We hope you keep joining us and sharing your, your amazing year with yes, us. Yes, I will. I will. I just want to say, guys, I'm very proud of you three of you. You guys have done some amazing stuff, had a lot of amazing mm. achievements over the last year. And I love three of you completely. So continue to achieve. And I hope 2022 is an equally successful year for you guys. Appreciate it. Thank Thanks you, Laura. That was awesome. All right. Kevy, okay. Kev. Kevin's in here. Kev, yeah, Kevin, come Kevin, defend yourself. my brother. Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. Miss Laura, all you have to do is teach one of them boys to cook dumplings and teach the next one to cook dumplings. They'll see. <laughs> and all I eat all the whole thing problem, son. <laughs> dumplings and lentils, please. They go figure it out. <laughs> all right? Hey. Kelly, you're going to eat all your soggy bacon them and chill. I don't know what the Italian is saying. I want to soggy bacon when down there and it means to you. Wow. wow. You could call me all kind of dog. And the nice thing about that dog, a dog loyal and a cheap real secret. Wow. And we wow. went and eat soggy bacon to that. Wow. That was wow. harsh. Wow. All of us, we just do that. You see the money? And yes, and I love what everybody had to get the back story. All of us in this freezing cold just run and support one another with warm moods. All of a sudden, <laughs> This is going time to go from this place. You go for Christmas and you'll be back here by the fourth. Because everybody knows going to get brick by the from the fifth moving forward. All of a sudden, you want to sit away yourself in chair and on 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 the bit and shark and all kind of thing. On the on the tenth and the eleventh. You know the madness I treat now nah, I treat on the eight hand. That says you go and see them in December. But it's a winter etiquette. Winter oh. etiquette. You leave September, you have from September down to December. By January 40th, you have to be back. Wow. You have to come back and stuff and rally and stuff. Look, neighbor. You tell me, I'm not cheating. Hello, Kevin. Oi, oi, Where's the oh. love? I'm Nikki, next year. I'm going through a draw, I don't know, but I, I wanted to just. Deal with Kelly here before I come to you because when I come to you and I climb down. Yeah, yeah. Going through yeah. Wow. Yesterday, Kelly done now. Kelly, 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 Kelly done. Oh, done now, yeah. Kelly done. How much? How much? How much? Kelly you done. Come on, to saw. Kelly done. Kelly done. Play for that. Just stop your don't twist man. Kelly, man, you're wicked. Practice in Obia, man. Stop practice Obia. Next set of pictures, eh? Where is that one, mate? Hey. You know, I must say in Florida, I ain't missing too much. I find like everything I could find in Florida is too fun. I feel like every, everything, eh? But, they, you know, if yeah. you can find the mental here, yeah, you're good. Yeah, yeah, that, you're is, good. that is Florida. It's uh, three hours away, right? You, you kind of hear what you yeah. use? Yeah. You hear what you use, Nikki? You in Chatham. <laughs> Chatham Village in Point from Grand, from Digo. So you drive from Digo to Chatham. Yeah. It's the same yeah. length time. It's the same length of time it took me to go mommy. So you really in final. You just ain't, the only problem to come yeah, by yeah, you. Yeah. The only problem is that you had a little visa and a little money. You gotta drive down. But other than that, you ain't that far. You ain't that far. Bunny, yeah, boy. Bunny. Let me mm-hmm. see Bunny. Like your Bunny to touching quick. Bonos. Oh, Jags. Nikki. Welcome. Welcome to show. I missed you last week. Yeah, I do the technical problems with Twitter. Nikki, no, um, just now, just now, buddy, just now, let me go back and, and check. Nikki Bunny wasn't here last week, you know, so I don't know what he's talking about, miss. You were. Not here. Yeah. 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 I was here. I was oh, here. I was, I was here, Lily. Don't try that. Don't try that, Lily. <laughs> Kevin misbehaved Bunny. last week too bad. Watch me. Uh, uh, uh. And Lily the gatekeeper. Yeah. Lily could tell her all who was and who wasn't. Yeah. Eh? That's reminding her. That is the gatekeeper. Let be careful. But do you have any dreams for this year? Anything you want to accomplish this year? I All I really want to accomplish this year is for all my friends to keep winning and the world to be a better place, you know, Nikki, because that is all we could really ask for, you know. Once mm-hmm. every day we above ground is a good day and a wish. Good day. The way all the place is going right now, you know, we had a wish to see another day, honestly. I hear that. Mm-hmm. Good. All right. Yeah. Coolo, 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 coolo. Oh, and pleasant good night um, to Kelly out of New Jersey. I came in just in the nick of time. Yeah, and for the, yeah. person, the person who wants to know this hour bunny and meeting, well, 
Jags and them go know my second portfolio despite all the linemen and the party and you know so I, I, I it's all about time and place yeah 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 we know so, you know you have good work you have good work you have good work too man I didn't know that high yeah. profile yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Meetings, you're not homeless yeah, you're not homeless yeah, yeah, yeah. you're not homeless you're not homeless at yeah all. so yeah Kelly it was a pleasure chilling with you you know it was real uh, awesome and and as Kelly endorsed, you know, concept series on the Ojo, I ain't trying to promote the thing, but I had to say it hats off to you all guys, Nikki, um, Jaiga, and Rody. Yeah, concept series. I look, well, I guess Kelly and I and everybody else here, we look forward for concept series 2022 because <laughs> it wasn't only about bringing entertainment to folks in the, pan- in the pandemic, it was also bringing persons closer. So, it's only a short time, Jaiga gave me. So, yeah, Jaik, thanks. Back yeah, to man. you. That's the love. Okay. Um, Thank you, Bunny. Well, boy, <laughs> we went to a concert series talking here tonight. That's what we talk about. We're talking about um, the dreams and your dreams and the things that you're looking for. And as I keep calling it, 2020 new. And for me personally, I, start, I started a journey last year and I just wanted to continue. Um, what I could say for me, definitely more school, more books. The the the, uh-huh. the 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 my ad- new addiction is learning, so I want to just stay on that journey and continue doing that. So hopefully by the end of 2020, new, I can add some other certificates to what I've been gathering up, so you guys can ask, and I will say, yeah, I get that too, and I have that too, and I have that too, and that's the direction yeah. I'm going. And of course, I was I fortunate. I, that, yeah. yeah, and and my, my pen get back a little sharp, so I, my pen my pen have a little have a little thing in it, so I using it, uh-huh. meaning I'm a little tune on them that part. I write it so I bad right now. I boo. See my chest high. I peacocking all day. My thing is my things, and you know I bad at that. And I have a real tune coming still. So I ain't going done for it. You know, putting out tune from now till December. You think? Jaga don't say I say, mm. but they say that your music coming in hard and strong because you're a woman by your side. <laughs> A homeless girl, a homeless. That was nappy, that was nappy. <laughs> <laughs> they say to get Tasha.gog.tts. That's the energy I push in. I'm telling you. Um, anybody, Um, first, before we move further, um, I want to bring in Paula. Paula is always be here. I want to bring in Ace. I want everybody in this space, please feel free to raise your hand. Hi, and come and spring. And she's not in yet. And feel free to raise your hand and come in and share with us what is some of the things you want for 2020 new. And we are here to encourage you to make sure and be your gatekeeper. Uh, let me just bring in Dr. Amala. Say a few open words because she's already in the thing. Night. Hey, Doc. Hi, everybody. Happy New Year. And um, I just want to wish everyone, um, one, I think you need to just do your list of, I wouldn't say affirmations, but goal setting as opposed to doing resolutions. Because with resolutions, you know, sometimes when you don't achieve something, two weeks into it, then you want to scrap and, you know, you you completely um, give up on stuff. But if you do a list like a vision list, then extend how long you want to do it for one and secondly have an accountability partner and as Jaga started by saying in the beginning let's each hold each other accountable um, I think you'd get more accomplished that way um, I'm not going to talk about my list I have a list of 300 things that I want to accomplish by by the end of next year and it's an extensive list but you know I, I think if, if I get 10% of it accomplished it would have been good but it took me some time to write this list of 300 things and I think everybody can get a list of 300. All right. Cool, guys. I'm going to tell a list. Our list very, very kind of different and it's intimidating. One of the things is on a list is to teach her nephew. Is it is, well, how old is he again? 10 or 6? He's 6. Yeah, her 6 year old nephew to play chess. The other thing is to go to Apple. Where's the name of the place? Anyways, it all it long <laughs> and it's real plenty and it's intimidating. So yes, I I heard that said that and I was about I see my work and I see me this thing I thought this is a free thing. Yeah, now that list hard. Who is that one? Yeah, it's hard, it's hard, it's hard. What? What's that, Kevin? I see you talk when I get three hundred things by next night. What can I see me this something? I thought this is a comfortable thing. But what can I think of the camera? Why that one, mate? Here's what it is, though. I actually heard. Steve Harvey talk about this list. He said he has two um, two scriptures that he lives by. One is 
um, write the vision and make it plain. Meaning, any he said anything that somebody rich or accomplished has achieved, they can go back and say, "Listen, I had this written down a couple of years ago. Let me show you." So that's one: write the vision and make it plain. And the second one he said is, "You have not because you ask not. Because if you believe in God, then you should yep. be asking God for things." And yep. that's the energy from which he said. He said, write a list of 300 things. Go back to it. He said, when you get to like 75, you'll be like, oh my gosh, I can't finish this. List. You're not asking big enough. Start thinking of if you want a car, what color you want it, if you want more than one car, you know, all those things. So really get into detail and really ask God for the things that you want. And so it was from that space that I did it. So one of the things is actually to play chess with my six-year-old nephew. I taught him to play already. So now I want to go and sit physically and play with him. So that's one of the things that I'm like, nobody wants to play chess with a six-year-old. Nobody. Ah. Nobody. <laughs> nobody. Right now I want to know, I need, I'm trying to come up with an app where we can we can loan out six and seven and eight-year-old and up to 13, where we could send them somewhere and get them back when they do well. That's the app I want to develop because churn is a headache. Please Oh, good. Only I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> All right. All right. Pa- uh, pa- pa- I hope, Dr. Amal, I hope you're, you're prepared. I hope you are mentally prepared if you lose to the six-year-old. They're both here. Yeah, oh God, yeah. I know, right? Oh, it's right, both of you. Yeah, for real. For <laughs> I know. Real. Paula, good night. Good night, everybody. Nikki, darling. I missed you last week. And Paula. I, I, mm, they're trying to keep the black woman down, you know <laughs> what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> but um, I, I, I want to be trying to express what I expressed last week. You know, I thank you, Rudy, Jiger, Kevin, everybody on the spaces. You know, um, what helped me through this whole pandemic was really listening to the breakfast party, listen, come in here on these spaces, you know, really look next shirts and, and give me that reconnection with Trinidad because um, for those of you who don't know, I do live on site. So, you know, thank you for all that you do for your service. I know you all hear it a thousand times, but I just want you to know that you have a fan here too, with you. So, um, in terms of what I want to achieve for 2022, um, well, I started a master's program in mental health counseling last year. Actually, it's been in the making. I've been toying with it for the last 15 years. And I think with, me, with COVID um, slowing me down, I had no choice but to confront and decide. So I started that. And once I started it, I was like, what the hell did I get myself into? Because my life was really good before. Um, so I just want to be able to continue that and you know, take it day by day. I have a discussion on the paper due to it. We haven't read any chapter yet, so spend my time in spaces. That's the story, that's the story of know. that's the story of all of our lives, bro. That's the story of everybody's life. Yeah. Yeah. Always have a people. Paula, do... Hopefully we will inspire you. Yeah, no, no, you guys have. Um and then the second thing I wanted to do because what I, that that um what I do now and what um this new masters I'm doing is like chalk and cheese. Um, and so wanted to transition my mind in terms of that new career, that new career path. One of the things I want to do is do, um, coaching around, um, mental health trauma. Um, there's three stages of trauma and what my faculty advisors told me I could start helping with the first and the third stage, which really helps with emotional regulation and reconnection. With that, I think I told, um, you guys on the spaces, I do not enjoy social media. And I know I have to do the website and all that, but I need help. So if there's anybody y'all could recommend who could help push that along for me, you know, just hit me up in um, DM and let me know, recommend any companies that you know are good and so I can check it out and of course, get man. that part that. of it moving. We could do that, yeah. for sure. That, and uh, other than that, health and strength for everybody. That's what I wish, and to be in service of others. Yes, I. Awesome. Thank you, Paula, for sharing. I want to ask Dr. Mala something because um, I think I go through it too and and maybe many people go through it where you, 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 you say, okay, you want to do these things and then you start to change your mind and then you start to doubt yourself and, and then before you know it, another year passed and you haven't even attempted. Is it is this something that we individually go through or is it that we 
constantly have to keep pushing ourselves, keep reminding ourselves that this is what we want to do or what we want to achieve? Um, I, I think that it happens to everybody. Um, but one of the things is having an accountability partner. Like I said, if you tell someone that you intend to do this, then unconsciously they're going to come say, oh, but how is that thing going? If you say to them, listen, I need you to be an accountability partner, then they know it's their job to ask you. And so they uh-huh. keep you in line. And unconsciously now, because you know that someone is going to ask you about it, then you don't want to be a failure. You don't need somebody to say, oh, well, come to man. How, what do you mean? You know, uh-huh. So uh-huh. I think having people along on the journey with you, and sometimes people say, oh, I don't want to share this until I get to a certain point or whatever. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. You, you're probably not thinking big enough or you probably don't understand how collaboration works. Because if you uh-huh. collaborate, you get further together. Yes, collaboration. Speak your, speak your uh, ideas into the universe, you know. I still believe that. And that's what I guess Steve was talking about, where you're, you're writing down and, and it's out there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, how, how, do you deal, how do you deal, just to add to that, Dr. Mala, how do you deal with the, um, the stress or should, or should I say the depressiveness that when you believe that you accomplish too much and you look back like you ain't really doing that stuff? How do you actually deal with that? You, you make your list. You say, all right, this year I want to accomplish this, 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 this. this. And you, you tell yourself by consulting with your list, you accomplish all these things. But when you really look at your list at the end of the year, you ain't really even scratch the surface of your list. And you just mentally, you sort of feel, feel down. How you deal with that? Well, I think you should look at your list in terms of, like if you were doing project management and you were using an agile form of, you know, so in Agile Project Management, you do a series of short sprints. And so you go back every so often and you assess. So you could sort your list in terms of different groups. And one of the major things, and Jai and I discussed this in a podcast we had, um, one of the major things with doing using the clear method to do your list. You'd have collaborative, you would listen, there'd be empathy. Um, you can adjust, which is the A, and the R is for reward. So build rewards into your list. So like one of the things I have is that I want to get a certain goal weight. And then when I get to that weight, I want to get another tattoo. But I'm only getting the tattoo if I get to that weight. So, you know, things like yeah, that. Yeah, Dr. Mala, what kind of tattoo you when I get you? I have to, I have to decide on <laughs> that. That's what watching your slide. Are you? W- one of the- <laughs> To Why black people so well? Why black people so well? I shame. All right, Dr. Mala. I shame. Gone with your man. Dr. Mala. Dr. Mala, can I add to that? The other thing, Kevin, the other thing, Kevin, is to be kind to yourself and 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 be grateful for the what you have achieved, no matter how small. Because when you pour out, you you leave room now to fill. And so sometimes just being kind to yourself and being, you know, yes, this is all I achieved, but I'm grateful for these health and strength to achieve that. And I can, and I can do better. And, and just making that room and space, then it allows you to fill it again with something greater and better. So. Yep. And we thank, also, thank you for that input, Paula. I needed that. Jag and I also spoke about making room if you want something, because a lot of times, like for instance, um, you want to buy more clothes, but you really have no place to put these new clothes because you haven't donated the clothes that are filling your closet and overflowing that you have on the clothes horse. In fact, you're using the exercise machine as a clothes horse. And so you have way too much clothes already, but you want to buy more things. Then if you want to... Why are you talking about that less than the people room? <laughs> <laughs> you just described me there. you. <laughs> and then... Then if you want to have a significant other, you don't have your place in a way that somebody else can actually come and live with you. If the man has to come, where are you going to put his clothes? You know, so you have to have those things, you know, in your mind. So make your space. treadmill where my clothes are. Wow. Wow. <laughs> no, 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 Dr. Mala. No, 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 no. Wow. No, that, no, Dr. Mala. Let me just let that part of it be a, a, um, a script 
Let me just take that out. Because we're not <laughs> encouraging you vagrants on them. So come my none of these young ladies inside of here and look for places to put their clothes. Then for all of them, keep your ticket in the trunk. Then for all of them, let it be. No, 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 the 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 depth of our road is saying oh, that is going on right now in these United States. Or they on that how deep our road. What road is saying? Mm. I don't know if he I don't know if he learned it from where he see it happen or he experienced it, but that is fact. Mm-hmm. Well, as a young lady, you, capital of that. I say as a young lady, you go a little event is a full blown interview, but it always leads into. You live in con- condition. Hey, where's that one? Me, yeah. How you living and who you living with. That is where you get into. Mm. And that is what's going on when they open the trunk and the whole wardrobe in the trunk. Wow. <laughs> no, 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 no. Don't move. Don't, don't like, clap too much. Yes, like Kevin and Rudy, like you come through, boys. See more, boy. Some spaces like, ago, earlier talk about when it's been a fella, and then he he kept himself, and 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 he doing well, and you break up with him a few months before. Maybe that maybe women holding on to that because these fellas promising, and they don't want to miss out oh. on the well, on I, their investment. Well, I real promising, eh? I just want to put that out there. I real promising. <laughs> 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 you see where I'm here in Baltimore? That is not the case, huh? That is not the case. He's saying I'm home and he playing the game and and that is all just for she to say, my man, uh, he, I know where my man is, he's at home wow. in Baltimore. That is what they're doing. So they wait to save the wet nowhere. Or to couch. Only taking all the garbage. That's the only thing he gets supposed to take all the garbage. Exactly. So Baltimore, I need exactly. To and then driving my car and going by home, boy. And then I had to stand up outside and wait to the cold to wow. tell him where you at. Wow. And you make money as a gamer, Marley. What do you make money as a gamer? <laughs> he not, yeah, yeah, what? Paula, he not <laughs> making no money. Nothing Baltimore. No, no, no. <laughs> Paula, I love you up to no. the end. Yeah, yeah, well, he's the best I hear. That we certainly heard. Well, at least he's in the house. Oh, wow. And um, he, he's not on the streets um, getting himself in problems. I want to make with a nine-year-old. We talk about it. <laughs> Wow. Exactly. Yeah, in the house I the my fucking other woman on the phone. The whole on phone. That, yeah. I, all I ask is it a nine year old or a forty nine year old we talking about? Hmm. Hello. I said, okay. I know they ain't coming here. <laughs> wow. So, so Mal, I have a question for you. Good night. Hi, you know, good night. Uh, so my question is: We're setting these goals. We're trying to achieve them. Mm-hmm. Uh, and yes, it would be nice to have an accountability partner. But what if you're one of those people that don't believe in telling people your stuff until you achieve it because you don't want to jinx it? Yeah, but I hope you have an airtight plan for that because sometimes you could be in a situation where you let yourself down. Let's say one of your steps doesn't go according to plan and it takes you back two steps then you fall into a state of depression and you can't talk to anybody about it and stuff like that so you have to guard against that nah what if you what if you cry tonight and enjoy any morning you're that kind of person Nah, you know, that, that, that's, force, that, that, that's a false belief. You 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 doing that to yourself. You you, you, you trying to you trying to you trying to trick yourself into believing. Cry today, join the morning, and then when it you, how, how to measure that cycle, right? Measure that cycle every six months. And if you've seen it, and if you know it, over the past three years, nothing has changed. Because let me tell you something: you might physically move where you are, doesn't actually change who you are. You think? Mm-hmm. So some people do that and try to wait, 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 pause. I want to write this down. Daddy, that again? Daddy, cool it now, cool it now, Dan. cool it now. You start to over, you start to overdo it, eh? Boy? Cool it now. So if I want to, but I really want to write this down. Sometimes you can so move, you, you, you can you, move you, where you, you are. That, you so. can move where you uh, are, but it doesn't necessarily have, change who you are. So I am that person. I am the person that doesn't want to talk my dreams out to other people no. but I get out into the universe 
so that you know all right, they can let, come into all right, fruition. Yeah, but let, so, let, so, let, so like one of my goals last year was to lose my thirty pounds of COVID weight by my birthday, and I was able to achieve that. Now I want to be an overachiever and lose ten more pounds. And oh, I yeah, also we, want we, see, we saw that. Have, Hashna, Hashna, you the and whole I, Instagram page and Kevin. Kevin, come down, <laughs> now, boy. We all saw that. Kevin, I am still sending off flies. Kevin, but, 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 who, but who is your sister? Kevin, Kevin, Mister Gentleman. The other, the other, the other goal that I have would be to, I, I was able to clear off my all of my credit cards what? by the by end Jeez. of. Kevin. The year last year. Kevin, you see what they like? 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 Kevin, you see what they credits and, and, and debt ratio, yeah. basically. That easy, neighbor. You just started leaving my ears. Don't let him come back. That all? That all? I remember you asked him for that 1500 borrow. Remember you let him be 15? 1500, neighbor. Yeah, remember the 1500, neighbor. Don't let him on next 15. Remember my neighbor, I tell all you about last week. Mm-hmm. Well, she was coming. Oh, she ex man don't do nothing. So, and how he unemployed. And she had to put him out and think, Basi come back, but she was sick all of this weekend, just like me. And she had to go outside. Like one more push, just <laughs> 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 she had to go outside and pick up she garbage can she own self. So what he there for? He wasn't doing nothing before. He ain't doing nothing now. We there for? Like and you sick business. and you still have to bring your own garbage can. Yeah, your own place, garbage can. Play school. Play school. Play school. Coffin season. Eh? Place play is school. very cold. Coffin season. Mm-hmm. Okay, neighbor. You dig? This is very cool. Paul, I wanted to say something. I saw you coming. At least he's safe on inside and he's not getting any problems in the street. <laughs> yeah, I wanted to ask neighbor. I wanted to ask neighbor about that thing. So there's a study out where sometimes when you talk about your your goal, you feel like your mind plays tricks and you feel like you've accomplished it. So I was just wondering, when you do that, if when the times you have done that, do you find like you feel... Like you have accomplished something, and to you that is jinxing because you don't. Um, some of the things that I have not spoken on until it's done. Yes, I do feel like I've accomplished it. Yeah, yeah. I just want I just wanted to to know that because I know sometimes I do not like to talk about what I want to do because once mm-hmm. I say it, I feel like I. I come on my way to do it, but I haven't done a damn thing when you look here a, a year <laughs> out or two years out. Right? So the funny so thing I, is, apart, before I before I moved from Trinidad, or I think it could have been probably within the months after I moved from Trinidad and migrated here to Maryland, I had made this Excel spreadsheet of all these things I wanted to accomplish in a one year, three year, five year um, time span. And um, I had saved it on my Google Drive, and I was looking for a file on my Google Drive the other day, and come to realize I had accomplished nine out of those ten things. I was like, "Damn, yeah!" Sorry, write the vision and make it plain. As, oh. as, as you, because now you can look back at this and say, "Oh wow, I actually had these things written now." Yep. And yep. Your subconscious does not know the difference. So if you say to your subconscious, these are the things that are going to happen, it has no choice but to come back. Yep. It's, it's, like this, it's like the scripture in, in Jiger Huffman, Matthew, where is it what? <laughs> if you pray to the Lord with me, if you ask the Lord for ask, ask, ask like, like you already have it, something like that is Matthew, right? I don't know. From <laughs> <laughs> faith, I Where you call those things that be not as though they are? Oh, yes. Mm, okay. Yeah, but but I will say one of the things that set me back that set me back real like like for years is it what like just to touch on what I'm neighbor saying, not speaking it out loud. I was once I was told at a, at a young age when you're talking to God, the devil listening to. So, um, 
Yeah, that's kind of mentally old, them old, them old folk things. And then... Yeah, but yeah, that's coming from get, our superstitious grandparents. Mm-hmm. Right. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And then later on, like, like in 2019, I have a real in-depth conversation with all of us. And she said, so what? Let him listen. Let him listen. So he can be in on the plan too. He have his job to do. Go and have his job to do. You have your job to do. Let the devil listen to your plan. And that is so what... what that's like, like the old people like to tell you yeah, about when they're coming in after a certain hour to turn around. Yeah. Walk backwards. But and that, I'm like, so the devil is around and walking backwards. Yeah, <laughs> nonsense. <laughs> nonsense. Walking backwards. Nonsense. It's, and, and what you just said there, Kevin, at the end of the day, this is how I look at it, right? Certain things like, it come like, it come like, like, I always call it the bounty. You know the bounty paper towel theory? When you buy a bounty paper, you can take a strap up a, a, a tear bounty every day for a week and every time you come in the house, it looks like you ain't use none. But if you continue doing it, you understand? Eventually, you will get to the end of the sheet. So the byproduct of hard work is, is naturally successful. You know? So that's the subconscious. People feel as though, but you have to stay grinding. You have to stay doing it. Do so when you do your list, don't just write it because writing it is cool. You have to actually feel. You have to get up every day and work towards mm-hmm. the things you put on yes, the list and work because, as I say, subconscious. The the byproduct of hard work is always success. You have ever heard anybody who trained for five years, do this for ten years, and has not lost weight, was not healthy? Well, if unless you have like a a hidden comorbidity or something that you know that's God. But I'm saying anything you do once you're working towards it, the byproduct will be success. I want to bring in tongue and cheek. We in him for the night. I want him to come and um say his do and ace as well. We had to talk to the both of them before we bust out. Tongue and cheek, good night. Hey, Hello? good night to everybody. And uh, we're almost at a close, but I'd like to get this in real quick. First off, I don't set any um, goals for myself other than to continue to be who I am. I'm a true person. I'm a good friend if I'm your friend. I am also, um, I would like to say, I observed two things that was left out the conversation about goal setting. Goals must be achievable and most important, measurable. So if you're measuring your goals along the, along the way, you will know if you're achieving. Because sometimes people toil and toil and toil and toil at a goal and they're not measuring to see if they're moving off from where they started. All right. Yes. Good evening. Good evening, everybody. Yeah. Hello. Yeah, buddy. Where's the scene? Blessings, blessings. So whoever was referring to it, it was Mark chapter 11, 24. Therefore, um, I tell you, right? Ask in prayer and believe that you have it and it will be yours. That's what you're looking for. Yes, yes thank you. That is exactly it. Come Not them, a problem. Look at them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, 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 Tongue in cheek, like I mentioned before, that was one of my problems in 21 and 20 years. The year before that. You just look at this goal that you want and you want it so bad and you just not you just not think I would have 15 steps in between you and that goal and the biggest struggle for me that I unlock in 22 so far is not to lose sight of the goal but your next my next focus is shifting your focus to what that next step will be to get you toward that goal so I say not to say like um, a big thing for me something I love my whole life is music um, I trying to get into into you know actually a couple instruments trying to get into some music production um, and I speak it into, the, into existence I think I even call it Sunday and stuff that's Sunday and yeah right. and, he, and he play and, he, and he play a rhythm I play a rhythm of his own life on here right yeah. and I just speak it into existence because you know I just uh, uh, I realised that that I had to, had to take them steps I had to humble myself be knowledgeable be willing to learn be open those are things I wasn't and also and also is also is you also have to have a good memory so when you actually have a rhythm that is going to be big, you have to remember that I played your first ever rhythm, so you can't charge me. So- <laughs> <laughs> you didn't see that coming. If, if you stand there or sit where you are right now and take the up in here, you didn't see that coming. The minute you mention Sunday, you call it. Whether that was you, your poor eyes, your poor yourself out there, come on. Well, I had to get yeah, something. You walk right into that one of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need get... to be reworking the rhythm because of what I remember, Daiga's comment is, well, how does someone like speak about so? Yeah, correct. Right. Yeah, that's Working exactly it. it. 
<laughs> That's exactly it. So he can't bite off and make Kevin so he do something. What the hell? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> I go on. Yeah, buddy. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Just to add one it, thing. It, that is a great accomplishment, but you get shown them to play with him, man. That is a great accomplishment. Rodi, you need to stop. Rodi, you need to done. Rodi, you need to done. The moral of the story is in 22. In 22, when you see your opportunity, season. Correct. We need to get an opportunity season. So just to share, a friend of mine, Shiger, Sa, my friend Sana, Mm-hmm. She shared something with me, and I shared it with um, Kevin and them today. Um, the uh, the idea of a victory jar. We always want to, um, you know, do um, what they call it. Um, Smear ac- Affirmation, right? Mm-hmm. But it's, it's a victory jar. And basically every month, at the end of the month, you write down all your victories for that month, all your accomplishments, and you put it in the jar. Mm-hmm. And at the end of the year, you know, you see how much, you know, all that you've accomplished. Even the small wins matter. True that. Small wins matter. So, Nicole? Yeah, they hold each other accountable. Nicole? Where is Nicole? She, she got cricket. <laughs> oh, she, she writes and she lists. She went to write and list. Rudy, you have any? Um, Rudy, what is the date? What's the date of the launch? What's the date of the um the first episode again? Because we just want to encourage everyone, you know, Rudy's sitcom is taking off. I think it's the twenty forty, if I'm not mistaken, is going to be the first episode that's going to be aired. So we're going to say congratulations to Rudy again. Um, I feel privileged and honored that I am working every morning with a TV star. So it's a great feeling. I can't wait for when the people start to call to try and get him, so they will call my phone. Then I can go into Rudy and I will just solicit real thing at the side. Yeah, I could call him in over. I'll link my back. He's not here right now. And you got to send what, me this. What platform is it going to be aired on? Um, it's, it's going to be airing on channel 214 on Flow. And it's going to be streaming on, on NBT. So the people outside of Trinidad. Um, so they can catch it on NBT. And just type up NBT on, 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 on the internet and you'll be able to access it. Um, in, in terms of what Dr. Amara was speaking about with the, with the list, I actually did make a list um, for 2021. The same, the same Steve Harvey um, episode where he spoke about that. I, I didn't reach you, Angela. I was on like 50 something and I was trying my hardest to find things that I could do, no matter how small it was. Um, I, I, I am proud to say that I did accomplish some of those things. Um, I think for 2022, I wanted people to make a list of things not to do. You know, so like becoming the father of three is something on my list that I think I need to write up. Um, Not getting COVID again is another one, you know. Um, How about not to be late for work? Yeah, that's true. Oh, wow. Wow. That was I just tried to match. I just try to match the energy on my salary. You know, so my salary is too much. You know? Bah! 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 Daddy! Daddy! I'm the greatest I ever hear. That is the greatest I ever hear. I greet this every day. The man is matching the energy of his salary. Well, if, that, yeah, if yeah, that's yeah. the case, Rodel, I need to not come all week. I need to come no, sporadically. Is, Monday, Wednesday, and enough. maybe Friday. If that's the case. That is what oh, wow. And and we spoke about accountability. I think there's a, a, a high level of accountability in, in, this, in this little family here that we have. Because trust and believe, when it is... We, we, Wow, like he, he had Digicel, boy. Damn. He has Digicel. Damn. He's not good at all. Damn. Digicel. Digicel. Where Nicole going, boy? All right. Let me see. You it's cut him. No, we're here, we're here, we're here. You see? So the level, the level of accountability in this group is what I appreciate plenty. Because look, the same for example, I... I, I, I I am in the process of launching a website with the merchant stuff. And every time I think about, you know, the, the steps and how long it's taken. I remember Bunny. Mm-hmm. Bunny, that man always reminded me of, we oh, you know, the merch boy. So I, I love the energy here that is keep us on our P's and fields. And I don't be sharing my goals and aspirations with you guys. 
my my approach to merchant all here in all here fellas who doing great things. I know how to get you know. I know how to get all here to get merchant. Kevin too boy, good boy. Para. Kevin is just printing and putting all the boy. Kevin is a Chinese yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Kevin working. Well, I am not. Kevin is a Chinese yeah, boy. One of my one of the things on my list, and it, I, I realize it from since the China. I am not again. Nobody <laughs> I want to support for the thing. Anytime you play more and put it on Instagram or put it on social media, I am printing. I am gamer because I can't say, you know, all right, man, get for Jersey. All right, all right. You know, all right. What boy, Kevin? All right, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Quality. Quality has to be right up. I have to be quality. Print, boy. Boy, it's three years now, boy. Wow. No, no, no. Wow. Okay, bro. Okay. Nicole, are you there? So, David. Oh, Nicole just was out I think Nicole see two came on outside and, and gone outside with Jay Cole. Yeah. And gone, boy. Nicole just gone. All right, guys. Lily, you coming in? It's not really how much? Yep. Right. Here we go. Okay. So, good night, everybody. Um, I don't know if Nikki gone or she here, but she was with us looking for a place to sing up and skin up, as she said. But we don't know where she is right now. Jagger was snitching on Rudy like a spoiled child. Talk to Rudy, yeah? But he forgets to say that Rudy is actually becoming Jagger.20 wow. in that alone. Wow. Wow. Wait, that one. Jagger is still not owning up to the truth about the woman that tell him, if you go in the spaces, you cannot come in my spaces. All right? <laughs> he want to say it. I don't believe in that how it is. Rudy reach inside of here. And nobody going to talk about how Rudy come inside of here. 8.15 and strong like he now gets up like if it's 8.15 in the morning mm. so what we feel happen is that he washed the wares out of the yard early so we ain't hear no crickets tonight in the background neither the crapo so chances are he gets in on the good side and he may not be sleeping outside tonight Marlene say government workers does he put spoon Marlene I wouldn't have you Kelly and Bunny was in a meeting tonight. Kelly said Bunny was in a meeting tonight. But how Kelly know Bunny was in a meeting tonight from all the way in New Jersey? I don't know. Laura is an amazing citizen of Soka, a journalist, and she has three boys, 17, 13, and 7, which means that despite all the love that going around in these spaces, she do have a chance down in Jigerville. She's cheering on them too old. So... While we were discussing goals and dreams, Lynn decided to pay attention to who was in these spaces. We had somebody named Montero Titty, right, Titty, with nothing more than a nipple in the profile picture. That person left. We had Double Black, which looked very much like Double Palm. Kevin said, Ke- Kelly come Trinidad and only eat a set of soggy bacon shots. Bunny sneaking in spaces half past eight, quiet like if nobody in see him, and want to act like if he was here all along. And before the space is done, he was gone again. Good night, Cal in Atlanta. Good luck. Good night, Adana in Santa Cruz. We see you here every week. We had somebody named Drink Water and Mind Your Business. But it wasn't Patsy and it wasn't DJ 12. So somebody had to copyright something at some point. Jamun, good night. What do you like over here? Dress the fed. Dress the fed, please check with Dr. Amala after the show because nobody has apparently told you we have no fetting this year. Dr. Amala will give you a time and date and, and course. Jada Cakes, another person that we see here, has always been here, Jada Cakes. Good night. We have two sources. We have Saucy 6797 and Saucy R. So maybe next week we'll have a Saucy S and one that will come at Pepper Sauce. I don't know. Dr. Amala wants to complete a 300 list. But she up in his faces every Wednesday, procrastinating. How you will get them thing done? We also have somebody named Juicy inside. Juicy, good night. So apparently, if he's a Trinidadian, only way to find out that he's a Trini is if your name connected with something in food. Everybody set goals for the year. Everybody spoke about what they want to achieve for the year. But me personally, my goal is to achieve 10.8 million something. I would have happened. <laughs> At 8 p.m. tonight, and if I see you, I'm not going to be here. Next week, Wednesday. Have a good night. Have a good night. Oh, good. Oh, she won the lotto. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. The lotto is 10 million tonight, boy. Can I? Can I? 
can I say this real quick? Yeah. Uh, uh, I would like to congratulate Lily for an excellent creativity in the summation mm-hmm. of every night's excellent. Uh, uh, spaces. I don't know where you get your creativity from. It's on the spot, spontaneous. And maybe you have a great sense of humor. Keep it up. And I appreciate it every time you do your summation. All right. Thank you. All right, guys. You all have a good one. Catch you all next week. You dig? Be gone. This is the third party, Jiger, Nikki, Rody.